It's time to unleash the chaos. Join us as we explore the wild world of Karen's and Kevin's. This is the most Italian thing I've seen all day. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm going to buy this stuff. Right, what are you going to do with it? Buy it. The whole thing? Yeah, the whole thing. What are you going to do with it? Eat it. What you Eat doing? it, the whole thing? Oh, yes, the, the whole thing. thing. Why is it? Can I not I'm buy this whole thing? No. Why? Because I say so. You're the owner? Yes. How I much you want for this? It's almost two thousand dollars. But what are you gonna do with it? I know it's two thousand yes. dollars. What you think I can afford it? What are you gonna do with Please it? Don't let me buy the parmesan. You can't. Why? Not here. Not here, my friend. No way. See? It's too heavy. A Karen at Woolsworth? Let's call her the Wooly Bully. None of your business. Go and get it done. You don't ever film people without that permission. Get Understand? I am Maya. <laughs> Absolutely. Stop. stop your filming. You, you need to stop. You need to stop. You need to stop. No, get them out. You need to stop. Who the hell do you think you are? You don't film temples. Who the f do you think you are? Turn it off, it's right. This is a private property. You cannot film in here. You can't. She's girl. being aggressive. She's being aggressive. I, I have, I have to, I have to, I have to film to protect. No, you're not. I have to. She has been following us, uh, swearing at us. No, you follow me up the escalator. It's gonna have to stop. Yeah, right. call. Hey, she I'm, has, I'm she has followed me. Yeah. Hey, I'm with you, man. Yeah. This is bullshit. This yes. is not fair. What you're receiving. Yes. I'm with you. All right. Yes. I'll have you bloody charged. You know what? Cool. You guys don't need to be around this. Uh, I'm sorry that this is happening. This is not cool and it's not fair. Sorry. You Get out! Get out, idiot! Turn your. You need to stop. You need to stop Turn swearing. You need to stop swearing. Mate, you tell them. Get out! 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 This person claims they waited an hour for their Chick fil A, but I have my doubts. Customer C order is ready. Okay. 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 Kevin leaves his dog in a hot car and doesn't take too kindly to a rogue dog defender reporting on his crimes. If I find out you videotaped my wife, I'll tear that phone right out of hey. Oh, you want to tip me too? Right, you Stop. Get away from here. Jack. You want to tip me too? So much to videotape my wife. You you hey, nobody is videotaping your precious oh, wife. Wait, he just, if it, she's in a public place, you can do that. You have zero expectation of privacy while you're in public. You can't right. assault people. Exactly. I'm sorry, but imagine telling someone that they have no right to record your wife and the only reason that she did happen to be on camera is because you did something 
stupid in public. Just let that set in for a second. We did not say or do anything to this man. Me and my grandmother were speaking to the dog owners who left their dogs in a hot car in a hundred degree heat. And really, we were just voicing our opinions to one another. There was not any screaming. There really wasn't any arguing until this guy took it upon himself to come and try to grab my phone out of my hand. And the only reason I started recording is because the dog owners were saying some things pretty alarming that I wanted to show to the police in case they took off or said anything else stupid. So the police came, and at the end of the day, I decided to not press charges because I have a lot going on right now, and this douchebag is not worth a single more second of my time. He did kind of look like he was his pants when he was speaking to the police. So anyways, piece of advice for him and anyone else who wants to act like a idiot in public, chill your and behave yourself in public. And if you're his wife, blink twice if you need help. Leave it to a Karen to make sauce the entire crux of the issue. Ignore me. When I asked for pecani sauce and ranch, you looked directly at me. Oh, you just didn't say anything? Pecani sauce and ranch? It's just ranch? Ranch. I asked for pecani sauce. I had a sauce there. Picante sauce? Tomato sauce. Picante. You no longer have picante sauce here? It's not, it's not to, it's oh. basic. It's tomato. Yeah. yeah. Is this picante? No, it's tomato. So you no longer have picante sauce, the salsa? It is tomato sauce. Do you have salsa? It's okay, salsa. Okay, are you denying me salsa? Picante salsa. sauce. It's salsa. Is this marinara? Let's see. No, it's not marinara. Okay, it's picante sauce. No, it's tomato sauce. Okay, sure. Well, then if I ask for picante sauce, why would you give me tomato sauce? No, it's that one. It's the same, but it's not picante. It's only it's tomato. Okay, well, you used to have packets that said picante on it, didn't you? Yeah, it's not picante. For me, that's not spicy. It's tomato. Okay, how much do you charge? 21 cents. 41? Okay, I'm good. I'll go ahead and take this one. I don't know why things are so difficult all the time. It's the pattern. If I'm asking for picante sauce, why are you saying this is tomato sauce? Those are distinctly different things. The Body Cam Chronicles has a brand new entry. Take a wild guess which type of Karen this cop will be dealing with today. Hello. Hi. What's your, what's your name? What's your name? You're not answering me? Are you feeling okay? I'm feeling fine. Okay. Have you uh, taken anything today? No. No, have you drinking anything today? Yes. Okay, you won't tell me your name? Prosecco and Tubbishla and Tequila. We're gone. Okay. Well, we're just here to make sure you're okay. You're concerning a lot of people. see my ticket? You checked it when you got on the plane. I didn't and check it. your company actually did as well. Can you um get up for us? No. Okay. Well, we can do this the easy way or the hard way. But I'd like you to get up, okay? Okay. Well, and her name's Alicia. Alicia. Yeah. Alicia. Alicia. She is alert and oriented. But I'm an EMT. Okay. Medical you standpoint, she seems completely fine. Yeah. Okay. She Hi, ma'am. Officer Case, if I can get you to get your stuff and stand up for me, let's get off the aircraft so we can get medics to look at you. Alicia. If you guessed drunken Karen on an airplane, congrats! You're a winner. Please press the like button to receive your prize. Didn't ask for a doctor. No, you didn't ask for and a what? You have no jurisdiction uh, to you, do that to me. I'm a peace officer of the state of Texas, and the flight attendants have asked you to. You need to I get off the plane. I'm and I'm trying to go home. You're, you're, you're what, ma'am? I do, I do not trust the state. Okay. And I'm trying to go home. I understand that, but see, this is a business. So do not hold me here. You need to stand up and get off the plane, ma'am. No, I don't. Yes, ma'am. Delta Airlines is not going to fly you. Need you to stand up for me. Ma'am, I'm going to allow you to. For what reason? I don't. The airlines say they want you off the for plane. For what reason? Because they don't want to fly you. That's the reason they gave me. That's the only reason I need. Need what you to stand up. Reason? I'm going to allow you to walk out under your own power, ma'am, or I'm going to do it for you. Which would you rather it be? Neither. Huh? Neither. Okay, well, that's not a choice. Get you to stand up yeah, for me. Actually, no, ma'am, it's not. Let's get you to stand up. Ah. 
Just try to coax her up before I go talk to him real fast. If only it were that easy. Okay. Alicia, can you do me a favor? Can we do this the no. nice way? I want to fly to Boston. That's do you know her? the ticket I booked. Are you just that's my ID okay. that I got on. Right, here's your and choices, you ma'am. Tell me what did I do wrong? Well, what did I do wrong to not be able to do that? They said they don't want to. Here's your two options. Whoa. You can get up under your own power and exit the plane, or I'm going to deboard the plane and I'm going to put no. you in handcuffs and drag you off the plane. Which one do you want to do? What have I done wrong? American Airlines is a business. They have the right to refuse service. They have refused you service. Stand up, get your stuff. Let's get off the plane, okay? They're not flying you, ma'am. I'm not the wrong police. I'm just here. They, they don't want you on the aircraft anymore. That is their, so why you that's their prerogative. Soldier. I'm not a soldier, ma'am. I'm a police officer, yeah, but I'm trying to be, trying to be Kurt, but nice with you, but this plane has got to get moving. You're not going to be on it. There's nothing that I did wrong than sit down in a seat. Ma'am, we're concerned about you. Okay, well, I can be concerned about a too. It's your last chance. I'm going to allow you to stand up by yourself and walk off with me, or I'm going to deplane this aircraft, and then I'm going to remove you from this aircraft. Once that happens, you're no longer in charge of being able to stand up and do it on your own accord. I'm going to physically remove you from the aircraft. This is your choice. Of course, she chooses the smarter option and leaves the plane in a quiet and orderly fetch. Oh, who am I kidding? You already know what she chose. I Ma'am. I also all, have go. Yeah. security then. Ma'am. And then I Listen. waited in the airport and your people let me all in. And Listen, hey. Now you're telling me no? Ma'am, at this, listen, can you look at me? Please? I'm a police officer. I'm a police officer. Listen, Get this is your, your last shoulder. This is your last chance. Get Come your off. Hand. You're not you're not in trouble at this point, but Get you're not your flying. Hand off my shoulder. All right. Deboard. Here we go. Ma'am, need you to step up and get off the plane. If not, I'm gonna place you in handcuffs and take you off this plane. This is your one and only warning. Hello? Ma'am. Just pick her up. Yep. Do not take my belongings. I got the bag. Do not take she's, my belongings. She's seat melted in. You gave me my one and only warning to get off. Let go. Let go of the cup. Give me my one and only warning back. There it is. Stop. Stop fighting it. You're making it worse. Hold on. Let me... Is she uncuffed? Is she unbelted? Yeah. Right. Cuff? Is she unbelted? Yeah. All right. Stand up, ma'am. Well, the plane is empty, so now the cops can do their thing. Thanks, Karen. I got it. Yeah, you got it. Walk. Ma'am, start walking. She might not be able to. Can y'all get that, that wheelchair off? Just... She's got your bag in the bag. What? Yep, they got her. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Do you have any bags? All yeah, I was, yeah. All I was just trying to do was fly home. And I don't know why you all got so salty. Because you ain't got no water here. Don't leave me without my things. We have your back behind us. What have I done wrong? You were told to get off the aircraft, ma'am. Uh, For what reason? They did not want to fly you anymore. So for what reason? Because you didn't want to fly me? Ma'am, I'm not the airlines. I'll fight you till the day I die. Well, they can check her out. We'll get, that way we can get the people started boarding again yeah it's not a public offense I didn't even huh? do any of this let the walk of shame commence stop hurting me we'll sit her over here 
Let medics check her out. Medics check me out for what? Make sure you don't have any medical problems, ma'am. All right, cool. Can we pick that bench? Ma'am, did you have any carry-on bags? Wait, no, she had a bag. It was oh. Are these your only bags? Yes. Did you have right. a suitcase? Sounds good. What's wrong? Did you have any? Hey. I had a black bottom. Do not spit on anyone. I didn't spit on okay. anyone. She spit. I spit. Oh. Can. Where are you? Where are you flying to today? Logan. Okay. Boston. Boston. Okay. My flight was an hour late. Okay. Okay. Do you have your ID on you by any chance? And I got on the. Is it in your bag? <laughs> oh, yeah. Relax. Relax. <laughs> yes. Can I help you get your ID out really quick? Yes. If you unhandcuff me, no, no, that's we'll not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm just gonna help you. I don't need that. No, it's not in there. Is it in this one? Can I go in this one? No. Give me your purse. This one? Yes. Okay. Right, can you tell me your address really quick? So, you're learning oriented. I don't have Sunday to. Listen, listen to me. Listen to me really quick. Just, I'm, I'm, I'm here for you. I'm listen to you. Listen dumb. to me. You told me not to touch you. I'm not going to evaluate you. Me. You're learning oriented. You're from here, me like, from here, you're gonna be you're gonna be with to the officers. Go. Do you want me to go away? <laughs> yeah, because you're not helping me. Okay, well then we'll leave and we'll leave you here with with the officers. Okay. All right, dude. She straight up seems like she's barely even awake. <laughs> Your business is always sucked. My business sucks. It's not yours. Well, it's rude when people are rude to you. What else do you have right now? Yes, there's a lot of medication. Uh, I do not. Alicia, are you on any medication? No. You prescribed any medications? No. So you just had your six glasses of wine? Yes. Okay. Is it the good wine? Is it out of a box or is it the fancy stuff? Hey, box wine is good. It's too, a $50 right? bottle of port, and then port. I had a glass of Prosecco and a double shot. I'm tequila. So that's it. The gentleman has a bag. What are they being arrested? You're going to be arrested for, for criminal trespass. In public what, if, what if I trespass? You didn't get off the plane when they told you to get off the plane. So you're under arrest for criminal trespass and public intoxication. So the ticket that I bought that I had a flight for. That can be. And then you're saying that I have to get off. You can talk with the airlines. You That's... had it. The airline has a right to refuse service, ma'am. They can tell you they no yeah, longer want you to fly. Service, anyways. You can. I already knew that. They'll never get better. Let the walk of shame part two commence. I need my suitcase as well. That will be, it's on the aircraft that will be delivered. All right, I got her legs. We're walking. Walking. Watch out, watch out, watch out. No, try to kick me. You want to stay right here with me? Yeah. yeah. Stand her up. Yeah, my ID. My ID. Take it to ride. I will prone you out if you don't stop kicking. Well, you just want a small bit of bum now? Can you get her foot while I go? Yeah, go ahead. Oh. All right. Just prone her out. Stop. All right, go finish ahead. up. Go finish ahead. Up it's not like you've already done this before. 
it's not very nice to kick me in the foot. She's, it's also not to hold nice to hold people's foot down. Get in. Where's my belongings? They're gonna go with you. Where are they? They're there. All things considered, she's been relatively calm thus far. Oh, wait. <laughs> Never mind. Stop going through my All I did was try and peacefully get out of the plane. And he wouldn't let me. Jesus Christ, how hard is it to get out of the state? No one cares about you or the people in here. Give me my things now. Stop going through everything. It's not that complicated. I was sitting on the plane. I was sitting on the plane in my seat. And you decided to keep me here. You guys are. F you are. F I was sitting on the plane peacefully, asking to leave. What have been asking to do for days? I don't want to be here, and I don't want to be with you people. How do you not understand that? Oh, they fully understand it. They just don't care. You don't deserve me because you don't know how to be nice. You're also toxic because your water's not good. Because it's dried up. And now you're just sitting here eating fast food. Laying around. Can I please have a cigarette? I'll tell you everything. I will tell you everything. Oh, so they put the youngest one in charge right now? Where's my wallet? Where's my purse? All right, Alicia. So this is what's gonna happen, okay? You're gonna get out, we're gonna stand in this little sally port right here, and you're gonna get, get patted down again, okay? And then we're gonna go inside, and you're gonna get patted down again by the jail staff while they ask you questions, you understand? What did I do that was illegal? Okay, well, come on, sum me up. What did I do that was illegal? Come on, step up. So you wouldn't come off a plane when you were asked to, that's criminal trespass, okay? And also it's- I bought a ticket. Okay, yeah, they, they kicked you off. Basically, they have the right to refuse service to anybody for any reason, okay? So once I ask you to leave and you don't leave, that's criminal trespass, okay? Not only that, but also you're intoxicated in public, and then also you resisted arrest, okay? So, you're under arrest right now, it is what it is. We're gonna take you in. Uh, they'll explain the whole process for how you get out, but you have to make this easy on yourself, all right? Because if you continue to resist, there's gonna be additional charges. Does that make sense? Remember what I said earlier about inebriation triggering people's fight response? Apparently her alcohol triggered her flight response. <sighs> Are you want to look up here to the blue sign for us? Excuse Man. me? Look at the blue sign. We gotta take your photo. No. No. Open your eyes. No. I don't really love her. Are you single, married, or divorced? Yeah, I'm assuming single. Okay. All right, picture's done. Go to your knees. Drop down to your knees. Go to your knees. Go to your stomach. Onto your stomach, water. Stop rubbing my hands! I said I could lie to you! Stop! So when I take off these restraints, I need your shirt. Give me your shirt. Do you understand? If you don't comply, you know what's gonna happen. Oh, but if you thought that was the last airplane Karen of the day, think again. Get up! 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 Get
So who do you think is the Kevin here? I ain't done nothing to him, Brad. Don't step on my porch. You're going to jail. Well, then go to jail then, son. Get ready. Get ready, son. I'm right here. Get ready, son. I'm on you, motherfucker. No. No. You're going to get away is, from me. First thing, I didn't do nothing no, to him. Listen to me. Listen Don't to tell me, me no the you No, right you're not. Brad, you're going to go to jail, Brad. Tell you, you're going to go to jail. Son, look, you're going to help me, son. Come on, son. Yeah, well, you might. Hey, Brad, look. I haven't done nothing to him. Old lady too, I didn't say nothing to her. Always doing this. No, I didn't. You know, didn't say right nothing now. to her, Brad. Kick the gate down and all that. Daddy, oh my God. Here we go. Let's call the sheriff, then. Might as well. Why? I ain't done nothing to nobody. For what, Brad? I ain't done nothing to him. I ain't done nothing to him. The lady is just minding her own business. Whatever business that is, I couldn't tell you, but it's all her own. This is going to be done. No ifs, ands, buts about it. Your property, your yard, your driveway, his property, his yard, his driveway. Parties are going to stay separated, and there's not going to be any more arguing or fighting or anything like that. You got an understanding? No, sir. I want him arrested for assault. Not happening. Why? Not happening. Man, he smacked my phone out of my hand. What are you talking about? If you think that's going to fly, you can go ahead and talk to the county attorney's office. No, I will, and, but I'm going to tell you right now, that's assault. He smacked my phone out of my Obviously, hand. you're intoxicated, so that's plain. Whatever, I'm not intoxicated. What's that in front of you? Well, I've had one, two beers, but I'm not intoxicated. Do I sound intoxicated? And it don't matter. I'm on my front porch. Yeah, Doc. Yeah, Mr. Bax, please don't. I'm sorry. Y'all got a supervisor? I want, who's the supervisor? All right, I want to talk to the supervisor. I want that man arrested for assault. I just told you, if you want to get press charges against him. Is that right? So I can just walk up, smack somebody's phone out their hand and not get arrested? Is that the what you're telling me? No, you're on video, sir. What's your What's your name? Swind oh, that's right, Swindell. I remember you. I went to put a complaint in on you. Did What's you? your badge number? Six zero six. Six zero six. Yeah, I'll be talking to Major Quarles again cool. about Enjoy. you. No, I'm gonna put a for real complaint this time. I'm gonna write it on paper. Make that listen, so much that right there is a bunch of bull. If I done that to somebody and went up to their house, he came down. I got video. He came down to my house. Do you understand that? He came to me. Click the video on screen to watch more fantastic Karen freakouts.